first time I actually played it. It was very much fun. It was very intense too. We get to pick two nations and then plan a strategy, fight for ourselves and defense. They're playing the same kind of war game that we would play with our normal military staff to help them to understand the complex set of relationships and interplay that can occur in any kind of military operation and how different decisions that they make can really affect success or failure of the operation. Here at summer school we get together uh, the old military leaders and on the other hand young people with an academic background and bringing academic and military uh, together provides options to support decision-making in military environment. National security is an important issue. We need skilled, technical, inquisitive, creative people. Well, that's normally not a problem. There are lots of people out there, but oh, there aren't anymore. There's a very real labor shortage across the board in the world at large. And so every business, and national security in NATO is a business with a particular focus, is competing for these skilled people. What will remain in their head is the idea of multinationality. And NATO is a multinational organization. NATO is not only the sum of a couple of flags somewhere on a flagpole in front of a command building in Brussels. NATO is the sum of its members. And the members are represented by the people. They get an idea of what the NATO is like and what NATO does to defend our values and our freedom. So that, that's what I would say to people. We'll use your skills and make you feel good about your, using your skills in a, in a good cause. Showing them how we do our work and the kind of work we do, they will obviously be able to see how very interesting and challenging the problems we work with are and how impactful their work could be if they came to work for NATO in these kind of positions. I learned so much about strategic decision making also for improve your mind and uh, learn um, about how to use your mind in every situation. I'm an electronics major, so big data, AI and um, machine learning, that is my field. I get to see where NATO uses these kind of technologies to analyze and improve their missions. We had a lot of information, a lot of different courses and inputs from very bright minds, um, different lectures from different countries, uh, which was very interesting. I would like to say that uh, if you have even a little bit of interest in the national security or international security, whether it is as an engineer, as a diplomat, as a completely civilian uh, business major, I'd say that it is well worth it to come at least once just to see the culture and see if you will thrive in here.